as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, It's that war... War never changes. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. This new haircut's really working for me. I wasn't sure, but I like the beard. Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. To perfection. And today's newspaper just delivered. Excuse me, Jimmy. Our government has police too. Wow. Bunch of our old holotape recordings. Which is why we've developed some whiz bang new weapons. So bullies around the world never bother us again. Well, Jimmy, maybe you should just see for yourself. Hun. Nervous? Don't be. Mm. Everyone's gonna love More the this same. Beach. Good old USA. Tech calling. Something that is unquestionably 
Vault Tech, remind me again? Why, we're about you, sir, and helping secure your future. You see, vault -Tec is the foremost builder of state-of-the-art underground fallout shelters. Vaults, if you will. Luxury accommodations where you can wait out the horrors of nuclear devastation. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Then I'm glad you caught up with me. Oh, me too. You have no idea. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a, uh, mm -hmm, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. But there's room for my entire family, right? Of course, of course. Minus your robot, naturally. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. Sure, let's do it. Splendid, splendid. Now, uh, let's see. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Mr. Nasty, Sean has been changed. Absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> you heard Codsworth. Go on. <laughs> How are the two most important men in my life doing? Spin the mobile a bit. He loves that. Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? I wonder what Sean will grow up to be. Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're, uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with say? our affiliate stations. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's, um... Confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh, my God. What's going on? Oh, my God. We... we need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. Let's go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Help me 
pack it up. Hey there. Yeah, about the stupid luggage. I can't. We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, ma'am. And God you help us follow all. me. Come on. What's going to happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? We're everything we can. Now keep moving. Step this on way. the platform in the center. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! Hold on! We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone, please step off hey, the elevator huh? and proceed it's up the be stairs okay, in right? an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home, Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. We left a minute later. No, no, we don't, don't get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up. Hey. Head inside. Just up the stairs there. Vault 10 no. is here for you. All new residents. This way, please. Please proceed this good. in an orderly Stay fashion. Stay to the table. Take a seat. Welcome to this way. Oh, oh, it's welcome. Pick up a suit right over there. Just sit down the hall there. Right over there, please. It's uh, down the hallway right thanks. there. Thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. Excuse me. See? Follow me. This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. Gone. Our home. Everything we had. My Sir? mother and father down in D.C. Oh, God, honey. What if they didn't make it? How long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical okay. items we okay. have to get through. Just checking everyone off the list as they come in. Is comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Everything okay? We made it. Just step in here and put your vault suit on. Shh. Who's my little guy? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. There he is. See? Daddy's not going far. All set? Just step inside and put on your vault suit. and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. <sighs> Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. <sighs> Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five.
This is the one. Here. <laughs> Has to be a release! Come on, come on, come on! Oh God! I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. Giant roaches? What the hell? Where is everyone?
Here's a thing, a, a sort of a note, I guess, um, from a sponsor here in Diamond City, and I'll, um... As I live and breathe! Squatters! Oh, it's, Own a piece of Diamond it's City really history, you. and then beat people to death with it! If if anyone is, uh, is you're, you're, you're still here. You're not, this is so, other people could still be alive, too. But of course I'm still here! Surely you don't think a little radiation could deter the pride of General Atomics International? <laughs> but you seem the worse for wear. Best not let the wife see you in that state. Hmm? Where is the missus, by the way? She's... in a better place. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. 
checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. <clears throat> You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you... A bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house and the car the car how do you polish rust stay with me pal focus uh, i'm afraid i don't know anything sir the bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry i thought for certain you and your family were dead i did find this hollow tape I believe the missus was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Thank you, Codsworth. You, you're welcome. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The missus and young Sean may turn up yet. All right. Lead the way. Two serves, sir. Picking up hostile light peekaboo. Codsworth. Mr. Nasty. Mr. Nasty. The missus and young Sean. They aren't here. Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't give up, sir. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and, well, the people there have only shot at me a few times. Thanks for your help, Codsworth. Good luck, sir. Mm -hmm. I shall remain here and secure the home.
coming, buddy. to anyway. Isn't that right? Excellent. But everything we do, no matter how hard, we do it for our family. Oopsie. <laughs> no, no, no. Little fingers away. There we go. Okay. Just say it. Right there. Right there. <laughs> Yay. Hi, honey. Listen, I, I don't think that Sean and I need to tell you how great of a father you are. But we're going to anyway. Isn't that right? You are kind and loving. <laughs> and funny. That's right. And patient. So patient. Patience of a saint, my mom used to say. Look, with Sean and us all being home together, it's been an amazing year. But even so, I know our best days are yet to come. Mm, there'll be changes, sure. Things we need to adjust to. You'll rejoin the civilian workforce and... I'll shake the dust off my law degree. But everything we do, no matter how hard, we do it for our family. Now, say goodbye, Sean. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Come on. <laughs> Bye, honey. We love you. Hey, boy, what are you doing out here all by yourself? You seem like an okay guy. Okay, then. Let's stick together.
group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please! Disappearing on top, wrong Get fight. Up. Man, I don't know who you are, but just how perfect. I'm mean, impeccable. <laughs> Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minuteman. God damn it. Glad to help. Well, if that's true, we could use some more goodwill. As you can see, we're in a bit of a mess here. <sighs> Maybe. <sighs> nope. The world's changed so much. None of this makes sense. You all right? Listen, uh, we need it. your help. And then maybe we can help you, huh? What brought you out here? My son Sean's been kidnapped. He's not even a year old. That's messed up. I'm sorry. I know how this world can be. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. First it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. Tommy Allen there with uh, <laughs> Rocket 69. Sorry. <laughs> Sounds rough. Thanks. It's good to meet someone who nope. really cares. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. Uh, 
Let's hear it. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. Protection with an added bonus. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Minigun. Now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. The suit's out of juice. Probably it can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Can't be too hard. I'll see what I can do. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. This is Diamond City Radio. And Please, I'm, uh, you need to listen to me. Travis. Anyway. That's it. This is a song about easy living. Just, just like here in Diamond City, am I right? No more British occupation. Don't hit Back to England with you. There we go.
here. But we got somebody up here. Why don't you get down here? Give me that fancy gun up close. Not a I think lot I got of people to get here. past my boys. I'll give you that. Steer away, asshole. Nat King Cole there. He's just the best, isn't he? Hey. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. The feeling's mutual, Preston. You can never have too many friends. Not in the Commonwealth. Listen. When we first met, you said you were glad to help. Well, you did. 
and we owe you our lives. So here, it ain't much, but it's the best way I can say thank you. I didn't do it for money. Hey, sorry. I'm used to everyone being in it only for themselves. You know, you remind me of my friends, the other men and men, the ones who gave their lives for something bigger than themselves. You should come with us to Sanctuary. We could use the help. All right, Garvey. I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? I've seen it. And I know your pain. Don't give me that destiny crap. I just saw you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a 20-foot-tall irradiated lizard. You telling me you can't keep an open mind after that? It's all right, Preston. Not everyone understands the sight. But I don't need you to believe. I just need you to listen. You're a man out of time, out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Where is my son? Where is Sean? Oh, I wish I knew, kid. I really do. But it's not like I can see your son. I can just feel his life force, his energy. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City, the biggest settlement around. Please, Mama Murphy, I'm working for nothing. I need more. Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. And no. now, uh, Mama Murphy, a word we talked for about several this. That from junk our sponsors. is gonna kill you. Ah, uh, shush, Choice Preston. Chaps. We're Once all you know, gonna die eventually. We have we're Just meet. Stop asking if we have anything here? else. He's hey. Gonna need it Sounds too. like you better get going no, to Diamond City. Hey. hey. All right, get folks. Going. Thank you, our friend here. It's to safe head. to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Thanks for it. Not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions when she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? it can oh, hold, hold on, hold on. Words, Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we're doing next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Excuse me. Don't worry. Come on, June, it's time to I'll go. I'll get these people to sanctuary. Oh. Okay. We need to keep moving. <laughs> 